Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 3.29 p.m., and it's Sunday, April 30th, 2023. Today is the last day of April, but I'm anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing a new flavor of the Alani New Energy Drinks. This one's another limited edition flavor, so it's out for a limited time only. Um, but it's not store exclusive, so you can probably find it at quite a few places, you know, but um, anyway. Um, at, I got this at the Vitamin Shop, and I also got another can at GNC. I'm um, at the Vitamin Shop is $3, so I guess okay priced, but I'm um, at GNC was $3.19, so it was more expensive at GNC than at the Vitamin Shop. So try to get it at the Vitamin Shop, but you might be able to find it at like Walmart or like other gas stations and stuff too, so you might be able to get a little bit cheaper, but um, anyway. Um, this one sounds like it might be pretty good, we shall see. Anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the new Kiwi Guava, a Lonnie New Energy Drink. So, oh yeah, boys, look at that can. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Very colorful, interesting looking can design. I like the look of it. Very nostalgic looking with those green hills. It reminds me of like the Windows XP logo. And they're like hot air balloons. They're what they're supposed to be, I guess. It's like a cloudy night. I don't know why, but it reminds me of like, um... The old Aladdin games for like the Super Nintendo, um, but yeah. What is the silver top? The silver tab. The bombs of Best Buy in production code. Best Buy March eighteenth, twenty twenty five. So it's still fresh for a while. Kiwi Guava, Lonnie New, Energy, natural flavored with other natural flavors, energy drink, 12 fluid ounces, 355 milliliters, zero sugar, 200 milligrams caffeine, gluten-free, biotin, B6 and B12, vegan. Shows some like leaves and some like stars and stuff. Shows the clouds and the Alani New logos written as like a cloud font. Looks pretty cool, but the Kiwi Guava, how it's written, reminds me of like the um, retro rainbow one a little bit. Like a retro style design, I don't know. I like the pastel colors too on the line new cans at the top and the bottom. It looks pretty cool. It's like a red sun, I guess it's supposed to be like a sunset or something. Because the clouds look more like it's supposed to be like about nighttime, I guess. I don't know. Like dusk. Um, but yeah, there's the kiwi and the guava. And they're like hot air balloons. Um, so yeah, very interesting, cool can design. I like the look of it. Stands out a lot, you know, just saying. Also reminds me of, like, um, Mario 64 a little bit, with, like, the clouds and stuff. Like, the green hills, um, actually reminds me of, like, um, I think it was Super Mario World for the Super Nintendo. The one with, like, Yoshi and stuff. Reminds me of, like, the first level on that. Where it has, like, the green hills and stuff on it. Uh, but yeah, it looks pretty cool. Has SKU, a QR code, it probably takes to their website. Um, the recycling logo, the AMP logo, and some other codes. Line New Copyright 2022, a Line Nutrition LLC, Louisville, Kentucky, 40258, some other codes. Contains 200 milligrams caffeine per 12 ounce serving, so with 200 milligrams caffeine per can. So yeah, definitely get you lit. Not recommended for children, people since caffeine, pregnant one, or women who are nursing it. Other ingredients, carbonated water, citric acid, taurine, natural flavor, erythritol, sodium citrate, L-theanine, caffeine, sucralose, panax, ginseng root extract, potassium sorbate preserve, sodium benzoate preserve, L-carnitine tartrate, isofem, potassium, niacinamide, gum acacia, nocetol, glucuronolactone, salt, decalcium, benethenate, guaranacea extract, pyridoxine, hydrochloride, biotin, cyanocobalaminum. Nutrition pack service has one can number, serving calories 10, total fat 0 grams, 0 percent, sodium 200 milligrams, 9 percent. Carbohydrates 4 grams, 1%, total sugar 0 grams, include 0 grams, added sugar 0%, sugar alcohol 1 gram, protein 0 grams, niacin 17 milligrams, 110%, vitamin B6 1.8 milligrams, 110%, vitamin B12 2.5 micrograms, 110%, biotin 30 micrograms, 100%, penetrant acid 5.3 milligrams, 110%. So yeah, that's the entire can, so let you sit right quick. Um, there's people playing soccer on like the field next to where I live. The field is actually... Um, well, we own it, but the neighbors are using it right now, though. They're doing, like, soccer or something. So they're, like, sort of close to my car, and they're, like, dogs are barking, so hopefully they're not too loud. I kept on a deposit a while ago. Really cool can design, though. 
very colorful can. It's a little bit reflective. That text might be a little bit hard to see. It's written against the background. I only see it when my lighting hits it good. It's probably going to be a little bit hard to see. I'll just soon let you see it when I show it off up close though. You'll see it a little bit better in a minute. Yeah, here's nutrition facts. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can. So anyway, now I'm going to show off the can up closer real quick. Then I'm going to finish my review for it. So hold on a minute. The new limited edition Kiwi Guava Lani New. Very colorful can. Very interesting, cool can design. Has some like rolling hills. Reminds me a little bit of like the Windows XP like screen. It's an or big orange sun. Looks like a hot air balloon, but it's like the kiwi. And like um the bucket thing it looks like it's filled with like kiwi juice. But um and there's the guava, and there's also like a hot air balloon. Clouds. Very, I don't know why, but reminds me of like old like childhood dreams. Very nostalgic looking can. I like the colors and stuff too. Yeah, silver top, silver tab. Um, it's the Best Buy Dayton production code. Best by March 18th, 2025, so it's still fresh for a while. Kiwi Guava. Line, I like the line news written as clouds too. It's a little bit scrooped up. 200 milligrams caffeine, vegan and gluten free. QR code, some other code. This KU. Distributor information and stuff. Text a little bit hard to see. How to have the light hit a certain way. Nutrition facts. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can. Anyway, now I'm going to finish my review for it, so hold on a minute. Okay, I shut off the can up close, and I'm going to shake it up a little bit, open it, taste it, and get my review for it, so hold on a minute. I don't even know if they'd know if I'm a YouTuber or not probably seen me making my videos in my car before, but um, there's these other kids that I don't even know, um, they're like, their family or something, so it might be weird, them seeing me filming my video in my car, but um, anyway, yeah, I opened it and the color of the liquid is clear, no artificial colors, a little bit carbonated and bubbly, and my dog bunny is barking at them, but um, anyway, the scent, Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Very sweet smelling. Sorry, they're barking loud, but I'm um, anyway. Um, definitely very sweet smelling. Definitely smell the kiwi. And also the guava a little bit, but um, I think I actually smell the kiwi more than the guava. There's not really too much, like, kiwi drinks. Um... Normally there's like strawberry kiwi drinks, but um, this is kiwi guava, so it's a little bit different. So yeah, it does have a little bit of like a tropical scent. It's a little bit like a candy scent too, though. Very, very, very sweet smelling. 
It doesn't really have like a floral scent though. A lot of like the kiwi drinks I've had before have like a floral scent. This doesn't really have that. It's just like a sweet tropical sort of scent. Um, but a little bit different though because of the kiwi. The guava is tropical, but um, the kiwi, I don't think it's like a tropical fruit, I guess. Um, but yeah, it still smells very fruity though. Um, probably the closest drink that I've had that smells like this might be... Sort of smells like the um, Rainbow Unicorn Bang Energy Drink. And also the can colors. Reminds me of that too with the blue and the pink. Pastel colors. Um, but that I think was actually a little bit more of like a strawberry energy drink. Um, but still smells a little bit similar to that. Or like the, um, a little bit like the Frosé Rosé Bang a teeny bit too. Um, but yeah, still smells very fruity. But I'm anyway now I'm going to try it. So here goes. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. And yep, the flavor. Well, 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 well. Has a little bit of like a bubble gum flavor. Yeah, has a little bit of like a bubble gum taste, but um, oh no, has a little bit of like a tropical bubble gum taste, I guess. So it reminds me a little bit of like the juicy fruit bubble gum, but um, juicy fruit was more like a pineapple sort of flavor. Um, there's still a little bit of a tropical taste because of the guava, but, um, yeah, it tastes a little bit different than, like, juicy fruit bubble gum. Definitely has a similar taste, but different. Might be because of the kiwi, too. Definitely has, like, a, um, sweet but tart taste. Yeah, very, very fruity. Definitely an interesting mix of flavors. Yeah, I don't know why it reminds me of, like, bubble gum. Um, but yeah, it does have a little bit of, like, a bubble gum taste. A little bit like the, um, the Strawberry Bubblicious Ghost Energy Drink. A teeny bit like that. Even though this isn't, like, strawberry kiwi guava, it has a little bit of, like, a strawberry taste to me anyway. Like a strawberry kiwi taste. So it's like you got the strawberry kiwi, like, um, Monster Reserve. Maybe mix it with like a little bit of like a tropical drink. Um, that's what this would be like. So yeah, it definitely has a nice, interesting mix of flavors. Definitely very flavorful. I guess the flavors, you know, match the can design because yeah, it's very flavorful. So the flavor stands out just as much as like the can stands out, you know, with the colors and stuff. Um, so yeah, definitely an interesting drink. A little bit like the Rainbow Unicorn Bang Energy Drink too, but um, different though because the kiwi. So I don't know how to really describe this too much. Um, definitely taste the guava, but yeah, definitely taste the kiwi more than the guava. But um, still pretty evenly mixed though. Maybe only a little bit stronger. Like kiwi, I'd probably say maybe 60%, and the guava maybe 40%. Um, but yeah, still really good though. I think I actually might like this. Um, I don't know if I like this one better than the retro rainbow one or not. I think I like them both about the same. But actually, um. I don't know, I think I do like the rainbow, retro rainbow one, like the can design a little bit more than this one, even though I do like this can design too. They both like, have cool unique can designs, and they're both very tasty. So yeah, definitely be on the lookout for it, it's brand new, for a limited time only, so definitely get it while you can, I guess. But yeah, very tasty, might actually have a teeny bit of a floral taste, but um, I don't know, the smell wasn't really floral though. Definitely more like candy though, but um, yeah, still pretty tasty. Anyway, um, energy wise, I'll definitely give you less 200 milligrams of caffeine as B vitamins and stuff. So I'd say energy wise, lasts about four hours, about five and a half hours of energy, may work a little bit more. So, oh yeah, boys, I'll definitely give you lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Really like the can design, how they made like the kiwi and the guava like hot air balloons. Definitely an interesting, like dreamy sort of design. Um, but yeah, definitely be on the lookout for it. Energy wise, it works really good, it tastes good. So, yeah, definitely try it. Definitely highly recommend it. Probably give the new Kiwi Guava a Lonnie new energy drink. You know what, boys? You know what? I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. Oh yeah. There's not a lot of Kiwi energy drinks. Um, so yeah, this is a good Kiwi energy drink. Um, but it's definitely more like a tropical Kiwi drink. So it's similar to the new Monster Reserve. But um, yeah, it definitely tastes a little different though. But yeah, it's still pretty good. So yeah, definitely try it. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. Anyway, so my upcoming video. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.